Alright guys, welcome to the largest city in northern Norway with about, I think it's 80,000 people if you're not entirely sure, maybe 75,000, but uh, yeah, this is the largest city in northern Norway and I've always wanted to come here, so I'm so happy that I'm finally here and able to explore the city by myself. Okay, so I just met up with a friend and we are up for a little bit and that was really fun. And now I'm about to meet up with another friend, but I have about 45 minutes, I think, before I do meet him. So I'm going to walk around and look for a nice Norwegian sweater to buy. So, see you guys in a bit. Look who it is. It's Pietro from... Hello. 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 How are you doing? It's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. But we're going to get a Yeah? Yeah. But you can do better. Oh. I'm not going to fold it. Yeah, Peter was in the video of mine from Finsnes, Finsnes Afelskamp. And he was actually born in Tromsø, and he was very sorry for him. But yeah, I'm not going to fold it again. He lives here, in Tromsø. It's so cold. Here is... Here is the bathroom. Very nice. Oh yeah, very nice. Yeah, I used to uh, go uh, near this lake, uh, like walk near this lake, going to school. Yeah. But now they start building something and doing something, so I cannot do it. Uh, go here anymore. It was really, oh, yeah. really cool because, like, in the morning there's all the fog. Uh -huh. just came out on the lake. And really, really cool. Awesome. So, Oh, this is the boat. That's and here's the duck. Hello. You can you can. Hello uh, there. Scared. Hello. What on hard it over there? Anyways, I see that the lake is frozen. He's standing on. <laughs> yeah, but okay. You know uh, why it's called Presvand? Kabetir Presvand. Go for. Go for. Means uh, uh, the Prius lake. Prius. Prius. Because a uh. Prius. That in this lake. A Prius? A Prius. Like a car? No, uh, no, a Prius. That oh, I'm a pronunciation. You know, church. Uh, oh, a priest. Prius, yeah. Yeah. Okay, I see. <laughs> a Prius. Serious. Uh, that? Die yeah. in this uh, lake, like. Uh, oh, it's not good. It's not good. And, uh, yeah, and uh, I discovered it uh, when I told my friend, oh, in the winter time, I want to walk on the lake going and, to school. Oh, he, he, and he's like, no. Nope. <laughs> and uh, she told me, no, you cannot do it. You cannot absolutely do it because uh, uh, we the, die here and uh, I don't want to die. I think I'm going to put my foot on it. No. Yeah. Yeah, I think you're going to put your foot on it. <laughs> okay, I, I told that they go great. I feel the leak, you Alright, guys, my phone died, so I'm on my camera now without my good microphone, so the audio is gonna be terrible. I do apologize, but we're walking on Tromsø now. I'm about to head back in a little bit over an hour or so. And so, yeah, so where are we going now? We are going to the soccer field. Soccer field, okay. Uh, yeah, I... Next time, I'll be back here in a month, actually, with my host family for a few days. So we're going to go up on top of that mountain right over there. And we're just going to go up. Go, not even take any, like, escalator. Or not escalator, but, like, uh, car today. It's really nice here in Tumso because in the... Oh, but nice and fall. In the winter, uh, in a fjord, called uh, Kalt Fjord, means cold fjord. Uh, there's, a, um, there's the whales. There's a lot of whales oh, during yeah. the winter. And uh, last time, last year, uh, my friend told me they were full of whales, all the fjords. And so uh, I'll be there. I hope I'll see whales and stuff. Oh yeah. This way. Okay, good. <laughs> Oh, I'm go, I'm go for she. Langren, yeah, the Langren. Who's walking? Who's walking? 
Grüße gut. Oh, oh. It, funny thing is, it's getting dark outside right now. Yeah, it's and it's three o'clock <laughs> in the afternoon. Does that screw you up whenever you come home from school and it's dark? Yeah, uh, for example, uh, when we changed the hour, it was incredibly strange. Uh, walk to walk back home, and uh, you, you will you will see it's getting dark, and you see like, but it's four and four in the afternoon. You can't get yeah. the, get the dark now. Yeah, I said that. Cool. Oh yeah, that'll be cool. So, den här är Petros skole. Kongsbacken bygges. Kongsbacken. Bygger av skole. Ja. Og det er uh, scientific part. And the uh, artistic one, like uh, oh, wow. music and... Uh, this is actually very cool to be honest. This yeah. is, it looks like a pretty old building. Yeah, it looks like a pretty old building and I think uh, it is. Oh and, yeah. Uh, the problem about uh, my uh, lessons is uh, they the, those my lessons are all in the third floor oh, yeah <laughs> and the canteen is in the zero floor <laughs> <laughs> so yeah but okay now we're here at the uh bibliotheque which is the library and i'm about to check my phone because i have wi-fi here at the bibliotheque so uh free wi-fi free wi-fi <laughs> yes <laughs> so yeah i will go in and i will check my phone now we are in the bibliotheque. This is what it looks like on the inside. We're about to go back out. Yeah. And this is the center. So this is actually pretty cool. Yeah. It doesn't look so big from the outside. Yeah, it's... It's not that small. Like, uh, you can walk uh, for, uh, for a while in the, in the city. Uh -huh. And there's stuff to do, stuff to see. Det är väldigt förskälligt ja. Där inne För stort sett, det är väldigt förskälligt Now it's like completely Not completely dark, but it's a lot more dark in yeah. What's the time, like four? Okay, or, I can like, show you the time on my phone uh, Let me, uh, I don't know, I, if you can see it, but it's uh, 3 uh, 23, 24 uh, I can't really see it on the, yeah, yeah three. but 3 24 and In uh, Storsled, it's completely dark by like 4 or 3.45 in a few days but oh this is really weird how it gets dark this early it makes it made me sleep like I've slept <laughs> so much in the past yeah, yeah. few days after school yeah it's it's cloudy so it, it's yeah. like uh, I think it's for this reason it seems more uh, darker <laughs> it, it screws my internal clock up like I get home I don't want to do anything I just go to bed <laughs> yeah I think what your internal clock doesn't exist anymore yeah. when you came here. Like, uh, Vet du Polaria? Polaria, yeah. yeah. Um, det är, det är kanske fem eller tio minuter fra Polaria. Den okay. dag, den uh, dag. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so hur långt är det till Polaria för det? Uh, för tio uh, minuter. För här? Ja, tio minuter. Oh. Är det när uh, oh, ja. uh, Nostrada? Ja, det är Det var här för det är huske huske sett kan du säga Clarion Hotel The Edge är huske är huske sett där så det var ja ja det var nedda hört du gruten är det the cruise ship är det the okay hört du gruten is uh, like a Norwegian boat tour company I guess and uh, you can go on tours throughout all of Norway on like the fjords and stuff in the west coast and up here in northern Norway obviously because now the boat's on Trumsa which is northern Norway but uh I do recommend a boat tour in Norway it's beautiful here honestly but yeah we are in the Trumsa centrum you can see Trumsa here and uh, this is the Nestranda this is the shopping mall and uh, basically, there's two, two shopping malls I think here. So oh, yeah, one, one is this one, one is here. Lufthaven, yeah? Yeah, yeah. 
<laughs> it's so cold. <laughs> yeah, and, uh, it is yeah. pretty cold here right now. Like, not gonna lie, I'm pretty cold. <laughs> yeah, and uh, or maybe to the cinema. So like the, I think the truth of life is inside. But yeah, here's the syndrome sort of. It uh, looks a lot better at night, I think. Looks it lo makes the city look bigger. Oh, there's a dog with a blue collar on. But uh, it makes the city mo look more like a city at night whenever the yeah. lights are out. Up here in the north of Norway, and I think December and some of January, mm. the sun doesn't come up at all. Uh, it's completely dark. Like, you cannot tell the difference between night and day. It's so dark. The sun will uh, uh, disappear after 21 November. Oh, so yeah, it will just be gone. Yeah, and uh, uh, we we will see only like a little bit of light on uh, like I think uh, near uh, lunch time, like 12, 11. Uh -huh. Well, and uh, we will be at school in this time. So the only hour of light hour we, we will have uh, will be in this school. Uh Dude, yeah, the light hour, I think it's called like the blue hour, right? It kind of looks like it does now. Yeah. As you can see on the camera, it's very blue everywhere. It's just like how the lights, I don't know how to explain it, but uh, it's, blue. It's, it's, it's really blue outside right now. And that's like our hour of light that we get in the winter is it'll just be blue. It'll be like this. It's this is the most light we'll get in the winter pretty much like this. Now we're going to go in here, right? Yeah. Dude, I freaking oh. love <laughs> I freaking love Trimsa. Mm. It's so cool. Here, about... Uh, it's strange for me. Uh, because uh, in Italy, we don't care a lot about Halloween. Like uh -huh. you you do. Yeah. Uh, in, uh, in America. And uh, they care too about Halloween. In Norway? Yeah, in Norway. Because they want to dress up like something uh -huh. and uh, do stuff for us. It's like a party and that's it. Yeah. And <laughs> so I went to the to this party and everybody was uh, dressed up something. It was, uh, so like like the people here do stuff but, and uh, yeah it's it's, it's re really beautiful because uh, there are no lazy people. Yeah, they with the everything is good for do something. Oh yeah. yeah. I know what you mean. And fortunately, it's almost time to head back. To uh, Stuschlet, it was great here in Trimsa, but uh, I think the bus is coming in uh, Kokrupkanu. No, uh, Kvartil Fira. Kvartil Fira? Okay. So it's 3.45 then? Yeah. Yeah, 3.45, and there you can see over there across is Kvartil uh, Trumsta. Trumsta. Yeah. It's uh, like uh, you, you wrote it Trumsdal. Trumsdalen, mm -hmm. when you say, what you say, Trumsdal. Trumsdal, okay. <laughs> yeah, Fashelli. <laughs> and yeah, here, such a cool city. I definitely want to come to university here after I graduate from high school in the US because this is such a really great city here. I can't wait to come back also. But yeah, we're gonna wait for the bus now. Hello Walsamna, I hope you enjoyed the day in Trumsa. I know I certainly did. It's such an amazing city. I really want to live there in a few years, maybe even go to the university there, perhaps. Um, but yeah, I'm going to return to Trumsa in a month, so I will make another video about it. And uh, I'll stay there for a few days, so you can really see what the city's like. I didn't really give that much of a tour because I was a newcomer there as well today. So, uh, yeah, next time I'll give you guys a proper tour of Trumsa. But yeah, it was really nice to meet up with some friends, and um, I can't wait to see them again. And yeah, so I hope you enjoyed the video, and hallelujah.